Hello everyone and welcome back to Chronos Plays Final Fantasy XV. Today, apparently we're going to be fighting Behemoth, which is kind of horrifying. Uh, before we actually do that, so what will let's it be today? eat something. Though I'm pretty sure this place doesn't have that much in terms of food. There's maximum HP. Maximum apparently it's not loaded. There we go. Um, smoothie that gives us a lot of resistances. And the Chocobo Club Sandwich, which just kind of makes me feel bad. You can be turned into a toad in this game? That's actually awesome. No, that's just like amazing. Prevents toad. I mean, we're gonna order it. I'm I'll gonna go feel bad about it. For you. But prevents Look toad? Out, stomach. That's cool. That's awesome. Now that should help us against Deadeye. I also have AP I could spend. Actually, surprisingly, I have a lot more soon. than. I thought I didn't. I, I spent a lot of it. Oh, okay. It wasn't that. It wasn't that long ago. I I bought some. Um, as for what I would buy, that's pretty good. Getting more MP. That might be good. Kind of make myself like an air dancer or something. Osmos Osmo Strike would be pretty cool as well. Death drop seems neat. I don't know. It's, uh... I also kind of want vitality. That way I get, like... Defense. So I'm actually thinking I'm just going to go ahead and do that. Yeah, that sounds pretty good. Alright. Actually, let's check out our... Defense. It should only go up, like, 19 points. Yeah, it actually looks pretty good. No, okay, Promptos, you look kind of bad. Alright, actually, we look... Pretty amazing in terms of stats right now, so I'm kind of happy. I know some of that's from the Chocobo sandwich. Um, let's go ahead and take that off oh. and go over here. Locate friends of a feather. No, that's not what I wanted. I wanted to locate Dead Eye, which is like right next to each other. All right, actually, it wasn't that that close to each other. There's an item right there. Phoenix down. We might need that. Can we jump over this? Time we to go. Can. Quickly, Prompto. There hey, no Jeffy. falling damage. You see this, Noct? What about it? Dude, I... We'll, we'll check it out when we get back. Because clearly you saw something when we were leaving the town. I did not. Therefore, I would have to backtrack all the way to the town. <laughs> or somehow over this mountain slash big ass rock. Because this is not a mountain. This is a boulder. That apparently, like, is just really gigantic. Look at it up on the mini-map. That is pretty huge, actually. I want to ride my chocobo oh, I missed it. I do know about the stamina can't boost thing. My head. I can't get it, really. I got it that one time back in Golden, where I just got it... Like, instantly? Oh, this one's no joke. What? Huh. All right, bird's eye view. What am I looking at? Oh, a giga, a giga toad? Giga toad! I need now. Eyes peeled, mouth closed. Head. Okay, this is things probably like not good to attack. Pronto, look alive. Or you know, look dead. I missed that one up. Okay, ooh, that was a lot of damage. I will... Oh, I got it! And I surprisingly hit it. I know this is taking a lot of my health, but... Uh, yo, Tempest. Try this! Gladio, man. <laughs> what the fuck? Do it again. Okay, we, we won! Surprisingly, what's what? I've come up with a new recipe. <laughs> good, Can't good for you. It. A Gigan Toad. All right. Well, we just beat something eight levels higher than us. I did use the Sword of the Wise. It's a little bit cheesy, sure. And by cheesy, I mean powerful and drains my health. So I don't really consider that cheesy. I feel like this was not the way I was going. Oh, 
I was probably going through that little crevice before. Alright, there's more toads over there. No, that's not a toad. That's a gorilla. And they're friendly. And I slaughtered three of them recently. And it made me feel bad. Now... Can I jump up? No, that's too high. Wait for it. Time it right. And... Ah, oh, fuck. Maybe if I use circle instead of auto run. Okay, let's try it. I gotta tap it as soon as I can. And... Oh, I got it! I got it, baby! Now, I'm probably not gonna get it that often, but I got it! Who? Who dares mess with insect? Hey, look who's talking now. Uh, oh, it's one of those are. things. Uh, I mean, it's not really doing anything, so let's leave it. And by leave it, I mean go into this dead end. At least it didn't try to grade us. Okay, how do I get over there, though? I didn't even... Tr okay, I didn't even try for that one. We do gotta go back and do that fishing for that guy. Um, I don't know when that's gonna be. I mean, it's gonna be before we actually go into, like, the next main quest. That's for sure. But we got, like, a lot of side quests to do. It was back here, wasn't it? Well, we're gonna pick up this high elixir then. I mean, it looked like there was a road back here. And if, if there's not a road back here, then we're just gonna go back to... Don't try the parkour off that tree, you goddamn teenager. I don't think there's a road back here that leads to this. I mean, this, this foliage is actually getting <laughs> in the way. Ugh. Eyes forward. Ignis didn't no. mean to do that. Oh, there is a road back here. All right. So th this will lead me to the behemoth and potentially my death. Hmm. Okay. Still. Oh. 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 Game. Something Is that it? Alright. Come on. Yeah, okay, well, I mean, I really wish... Oh, okay. I should have went down here further. I was going to say, I really wish this thing had, like, <laughs> the Fable 2 Golden Trail. Because, good lord, I was actually stuck for a little bit. I didn't want to go all the way around a goddamn rock crevices again. Even though this isn't really crevices. Also, I'm getting kind of, like, worried that we're going to just die. Thankfully, I'm pretty sure we've had autosaves a bunch of times with me running around. Haven't gotten into any combat, which is fine. Ooh, item. Oh, that's actually the way we need to go. War tooth bristles. Nothing down there. Real is there really nothing down here? There's really nothing down here. Alright. So the stamina thing's actually a lot easier to do than I first gave it. Credit. Hey guys, how's it going? <laughs> Stop it. I don't know what happened. There we got it. Oh, never mind. We did not get it. Probably shouldn't use the sword of the wise. We're not wrong. Okay, there we go. And I, there we go. I mean, I don't know where I'm where I am on the screen. Like straight up, I don't I lost track of myself there for a little bit. I probably should not use this sword though. It's so good though! Watch this. Yeah. And it's so powerful! Oh, and my God. health comes back pretty fast. So yeah, I'm gonna use it until I really, really regret using it. Okay, so we wanna go down that way. First I wanna pick this up, and then go down this way. Probably will spawn a Is that a Trent? Are you a Trent? No, you're just a tree. Right, but you're an item. Crooked Helix Horn. I wonder how long that food has to last. Uh, I mean... I know there's a bar, but... Like, time-wise, how long is that? 
Eh, maybe I'll check it out later. There's probably something in my menu. No, just the bar again. That's fine. It at least tells me that I have time. Behemoth Horn. Sweet. It probably said it on the food when I bought it, and I just completely didn't notice it. Or maybe I just noticed it and just forgot, because... Eh, I've been a little bit. What was that? That worries me. <laughs> a little bit. Oh, it's, uh... Oh, it's one of these. All right, so I gotta, I gotta get on down on all fours. Not. What is this freaking Thursday? It, it is. Actually, it's Wednesday. But why are we? Why are you taking the lead? Do you think I'm, it's because I'm reckless? You think I'm reckless, don't you, Gladio? That's fine. I wish there was a button to like burp or fart. So we completely blow our covers in the most childless way manner. Yep, that is a behemoth. Yep. That's pretty cool looking. He seems to be blind in one eye. Dead eye. The name says it all. Oh yeah, no, that makes sense. He has a scar, that poor, poor creature. Is he eating the chocobo Let's right move. now? Can I just make friends with it? I don't want to kill it. It's injured. It should be on like a, on a preserve, right? Behemoths have to be rare, right? That gigantic, people are afraid of them. They can kill a lot of people at once. What's wrong with your pecs, man? Looks like you got stabbed. This thing looks like it's had a hard, rough time. Deadeye, have you had a rough time? Can I pet you? Your teeth look surprisingly healthy. Th thanks. Thanks, Gladio. Come on, it's gone. Yeah, I noticed. Also, what was it eating? Was it a chocobo? I mean, I feel bad eating the chocobos because the chocobos. Here we I go. get why he would because he's a behemoth. You gotta eat something. And a big ass chicken is probably pretty good to behemoth. I don't think he's gonna live off salad, <laughs> that's for sure. Hey guys, how's it going? Alright. There's no items around here. Yeah. Foggy. It's Legend of Lagaya. No eye, no horn. We'll stay in range until we can exploit its blind spot. That's mean. Yeah, Legend of Lagaya, though. They had a mist theme, didn't they? I haven't played that game in a long, long time. Actually, a lot of PlayStation games I haven't played in a long, long time. I do want to find some time to go back and play, well, all of them? But that will take a while. Why does it look like there's something special on this part of the map? I don't know. There, there might be. Ooh, item. At least the items stand out. Oh, that's not the way this is, though. Yeah, though, it, le it, le it led to nowhere. Oh, fun fact, I, like, really hurt my ankle on vines, sort of like these when I was younger. Just going through the woods, and I guess I was just, like, running with my... Yeah, I guess me and my friends used to prance through the woods, and I slipped on some vines. I got to my friend's house, not vines, uh, roots, and I took off my shoe, like, very g gingerly, and, like, my ankle was just the size of a goddamn softball. And it was not pleasant for a few, well, weeks. I didn't break it. I just really messed it up by slipping on the roots. Yeah, I'm too big to go prancing through the woods these days. I wouldn't call prancing. Eh, it was teenagers things. We would just go to the woods to hang out. Kids still do that today, right? Exercise due caution. Pr probably not. I mean, now that... Ticks are like everywhere. Oh, God, ticks. 
If I was as scared as goddamn ticks as I am today back then, I would have, well, never hung out with my friends. Am I jumping over this? That's a yes. So this is a boss arena then. Guys, get in here. I don't feel safe. We've got the beast in our sight. Uh, no plan of attack. The behemoth should be headed back to its lair, is it? where we can catch it fully is off Is it guard. in front of us? Yeah, as long as we stay on guard ourselves. Follow Deadeye back to his lair. Do not let him see you, and do not lose his the trail. I can't see him. I'm assuming it's that over there. Okay, I see his tail a little bit. Alright, well, I didn't actually mean for that. It's almost nighttime, which is fantastic. Am I going to be able to explore this area afterwards? I mean, this is creepy. Because of the whole gorilla in the mist vibe I'm getting. Um, even though he's not a gorilla, he's like way worse than a gorilla when it comes to actual damage. I mean, this thing can use meteor. Well, okay, I don't know if this thing can use use meteor. I'm assuming since it's a behemoth, it can use meteor. Also, I'm getting like weird, weird reminiscence of Breath of Fire 2 when you follow the tail through the uh, cave in the beginning of the game. duck walking. I mean, I probably shouldn't get this close. Also, probably shouldn't stand up, either. He's blind on his right side? Let's probably stay on his right side, then. Also, how does he not hear me? I know I'm being stealthy. But... I'm also running with the greatest of ease. Is it supposed to be extremely foggy during this mission, or did I just luck out with the weather? I'm gonna assume it's supposed to be like this. Are you really going in this circle, you GD bunghole? Can I just meet him there? I, it, is, it is actually creepy. Also, I, I don't remember Behemoth's tails looking like fish dorsal fin thingies. I mean, they, I know they looked weird and scaly and kind of spiky. Hmm. Is this fog? Is this mist fog gonna like clear up? Do not turn around. Do not do it. He's marking his territory. Like when I when I start fighting him, is it gonna gonna clear? Up? I feel really bad for this behemoth. Like I know it's tor like tormenting the travelers and everything like that, but he's injured or it's injured, and we're going to his house. Did you just climb over that thing? Oh. Uh, you have discovered Deadeye's lair. Sneak through the stones into the ruins. Whoa. There's probably an item somewhere in here. I'm gonna come back here later. But yeah, I mean, it's not doing anything right now, right? Has it killed anyone, or is it just torturing the birds? If it's torturing the birds, that's bad. That's still bad. I mean, this is a chocobo forest. But, also kind of like nature, right? Does that qualify as nature? This thing moving in here, like... Eating the chocobos? Oh, gee. How? Why, guys? All in a day's work. Not really, no. Okay, there's some fire here. Inventory full of fire. Do I have an empty flask? I have a lot of empty flasks, actually. I guess we will make... 99 fires. Do I want to craft anything with it? I don't think I do. 
Dual cast fire? Sure. We got 14 of them. Yeah, you know what? Fine. That's fine. I'll do that. I wasn't using those anyways, probably. I'm not gonna equip it. <laughs> I'll use them later. Now we absolve the fire. I gotta get better at magic because like, I keep hitting my party with it. And I don't know how to not do that. Like, at, thir at first, yeah, at first I thought it was, like, environmental, like, because I hit water with electricity. But the, the time after that, I hit the party with electricity as well, thunder. And it wasn't in water, so I don't know. What was that? Ignis oh, Gladio, what are you doing there? Okay, is this is this boss time? Don't don't fall down there. Yeah, all right, never mind. I was gonna save. Uh, apparently, you can't save in here, which is odd. Slash, I guess this is a dungeon. Detonate all oil drums with fire to damage dead eye. You're really gonna make me do that? <sighs> hey, the fog cleared me? up. All right. Oh, that's some uh, important music we're having going on here. Fire? No. Can I target stuff? I'll say. Oh, he's on fire. Want some? Yeah, let's not lock on because we're gonna have to actually do this. Fucking prompto, man. So I guess dual casting freaking fire wasn't the way to go. Wait. Can I just? Can I just kill him normally? Okay, let's um. God damn it. Okay. Uh, Go ahead, Gladio. Nice work, Gladio. I'm on fire. Alright, let's go in here and use Potion, do I have any? I got two, well, I got four Mega Elixirs. I've got five Mega Potions. Oh, I missed the parry, god damn it. Uh, Tempest. I might be doing this the hard way, but I'm fine with that. Oh, I missed the goddamn thing. Try that again. Okay, wait for it. See the circle in his eye. Ow. Okay, we'll do that again. Detonate the oil drums of fire. Or just use your weapons to kill him. That's cool too. Okay, let's target onto his damn leg. Now, let's go like this. Yeah. Is the dual weapon your thing? No, no. I mean, oh god damn, dude, stop. Ow! Can make me use a high potion all on my lonesome again? And a tempest. You know I should have Damn! Okay, that didn't work. Why, though? Why didn't that work? Keep it together. I'm trying to keep it together, but he's he's hurting me. See ya. You're good for an evidence, 
Save the coffee for later. Ah! Ow, mate. Something to look forward to. Ah! I'm yeah. actually beating the crap out of this fucking thing. No, you come here. Where are you going? Well, I guess we're going around this way. And whoop strike. Ow. Do that again. And we'll like that. You you got it from over there, Gladio. Come on. You got it from over there. Try this. Close enough, right? I apparently missed. Got him. Behemoth ten to one. Kinky. Magnificent. Thank you. It just occurred to me, but this is totally like King's Knight. Uh huh? There's four of us, just like in the game. Well, then I gotta be a five-star character. Hell no. If anyone here is a rare, it's me. This is the nerdiest conversation oh. that I've had in a long time, and I'm not even part of it, because these guys aren't real. I'm gonna come down, down here, because it looked like the, like the back entrance was barricade when I came around here the other way, so maybe it's not anymore, or I can remove it and come in from behind. <laughs> uh, I feel horrible killing that thing. But, I didn't need to kill with fire, My hands which is slipped. nice, because I wasted my fire on, like, <laughs> on, on nothing. Um, broken harmonica. Huh. That might be important later. I'm just saying that because that's where the behemoth spawned. So Doesn't that's probably like the heir to got? someone's poor child. Kinda, I feel groggy when I wake up in the morning. You could try going to bed at a decent hour. Wow, I actually did not expect that to happen. Huh. Oh, hi guys, you just warped in from behind. Oh no, that was that was the way. That's gonna be it for this episode. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed the episode, press the like button below. If you're not subscribed yet, when you head to my video section, check out some of my other content and see if it's to your liking. Once again, thank you for watching. Hope you all have a great day.